Right, dude, you ready for this? Hold on. Shh. Oh, dang. Yeah, you hear some... Oh, oh, man. We're hotboxing it now. It's, it's official. Duck. It's official. Oh, shit. Oh, stand the... <laughs> oh, what a You smell that shit? God <laughs> oh, damn. That's the... <laughs> That's some gosh dang chili fries. That boy's dying. Boom! Smells like I just ate one of them pickled eggs like you back in the day. Man, that's cold, <laughs> man. Back in the day, you know. What is cracking buddy trackers? Yeah, with the fat boy! That's right, this hillbilly hangover! Woo! When you got a hangover, hangover where the guys that'll in. make you feel better. <laughs> right. You gotta try that. I know I changed. We haven't done this in a couple years, right? We're a little oh, rusty. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> Well, you, you got, got a hangover, we're the hillbillies that'll make you feel, feel better. better. Woo! That's right. Yellow, outlaw, and fat boy, yellow! What's going on, folks? Is that what we're doing with Hillbilly Hangover over here on the Outlaw Dipper Second Channel? Live the Thrill TV! Woo! That's what we're doing it through. You know, you know, I'm in Colorado, and Fat Boy's living in Colorado. You know, yep, man. back here, and I'm like, you know what? Fat Boy's like, you know, should we, we should make a Hillbilly Hangover. I said, that. Get Fat Boy, that's a gosh dang good idea, son. Right. So we're in a bourbon truck right now. Fat Boy uh, Squeeze. Yeah, the squeeze in here stinks a little bit. It does. Oh, gosh. No. <laughs> it's getting a little bit out. Smells like my bath water. Yeah. Oh, boy, son. I got to bathe in that shit. I, 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 I drink your bath water. I'm glad to hear so, uh, Apparently, that's what you say to, uh, oh, look at, look at my, my family oh, is home. I have to cut cut up on this if they break up my video. Gosh, darn it. But okay. anyways, you know, uh, 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 so anyways, we, uh, you can't see anything out of the back. Everything is packed in here. That's right. right. Packed in here tight like a tiger, right? That's right. Tighter than your girlfriend's wiener, right? I that's mean, right. I mean, yeah. 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 yeah that's right. <clears throat> His girlfriend's himself. <laughs> yeah. I'm saying, <laughs> okay. Uh, I got I two. Oh! <laughs> son. His wiener's his pinky, you know what I'm saying? Right, yeah, right, I, or right. the thumb. It looks more like thumb. Yeah, well, yeah. you know. Depends on the moonlight. Little, little stub. Yeah. <laughs> Depending on the moonlight. Anyways, we're here for a video today. That's right. We haven't made a hillbilly hang on shit like, what, a year and a half? Sounds I'm, right. I'm, the the long ever, last time. Forever, son. Woo. So, uh, well, first thing we gotta do, if we gotta make an official hillbilly hangover, then what the hell, what in the tits what are we dipping, son? Now, hold on, I'm, I guarantee somebody's gonna freaking come around here, and they are going, wait a second, where'd they go? Oh, maybe they were getting the mail or something like that. I, I guarantee maybe. somebody's gonna come, and they're gonna scare the living crap out of me, but we're gonna keep it recording just in case yeah. they do. So don't look at any of the mirrors, okay? I'll be like, I'll be like, ah, be. Okay, so anyways, what, what you dipping, dude? And we ain't got anything. I, I, I didn't get anything special. But every every time Fat Boy dips this on bitch, it is something special. So why don't you tell That's them right. what that is right there? A little classic. Make sure they see it. Copenhagen in whiskey blend. No, no, no. It's Cope whiskey. Cope you whiskey. Get it right on. Cope. Get it right on. You Cope whiskey. Oh, we got the sign little flashlight. Oh yeah. It's a spotlight. Cope whiskey. Look at that. It's sexy. Man, people, people around it, they don't find them Cope whiskey nowhere. Mm, you might be the only one. This guy orders it for him all the time, and okay. he gets Cope whiskey all the time. Yeah, special connections. Yep. Yep. So uh. Uh, yeah, freaking A. Uh, uh, what, what, where the tits are they, man? I don't know. Oh, oh, I see them now. Yeah, some car parked in their spot. What the tits? That's just wrong. That's We're wrong. in Yuppieville right now, y'all. Right. We're doing a hillbilly hangover in Yuppieville. We in the big and, uh, city, folks. We going, we're in the big city and everybody going out around there. And we got this. And uh, people are trying to freaking um, to our get, video. It's a paparazzi. With the paparazzi, y'all. Pap we're just we're just famous in this Yuppieville. That's right. It's not fun. Everybody coming down for us, and people are coming down, and it's it's just ridiculous. So we, we're in Yuppieville, Yuppieville, yep. Colorado, right? Yep, insane. Yeah, we, we don't tell them where we are exactly, because uh, uh, you know we don't want to freaking no. Send more know. paparazzi down here, be man. I can't man. walk outside my front porch I, butt naked. I know. Without a flash. I you mean, know, well, we got. Well, well, let's throw these dips in, then we got to tell a little spit. Uh, 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 I am dipping Copenhagen wintergreen, by the way. And uh, let me see how much got. If I don't even have that much in here, then I might have to dip some Cope whiskey. Well, shit, son, I'm gonna have to dip. Well, it looks like we're doing Cope Ooh, whiskey. Cope man. whiskey around, folks. Cope whiskey all around. I'm not a big fan of Cope whiskey, uh, but uh, you know what? Uh, I, I live for this shit. This, this is, is like. One dip out of that can. Don't spill that son of a bitch. Oh my dude, goodness. I'm like a if my car smelled like cup of whiskey, dude, uh, uh, man, I might just dump it out. Oh, you know what? After I, I throw me a hammer, I got to do a video, cup whiskey, and then mix it with Jack Daniels. Don't you think I got to put that up on the outlet? That thing? is some good shit. Yeah, I know the mix show for that. You guys think about what? What do you guys think? Should I do that? It's freaking good, y'all. Oh, that was Jamin. That was Jamin. That was my little brother. Mm -hmm. That was my little brother driving. That's what the tits they were doing. It wasn't my parents. Yeah. I was thinking because you know my parents and everything. I was staying with my family. Hmm. Uh, you know, I haven't lived with my family for a long time, but staying with them for a couple days until I go out to Cracker Cali and uh, help the Mud Jug boys. Yeah, Mud Jug. And, and, and my family's growing I'm the oldest. My family's growing up so gosh dang fast. <laughs> I'm old as shit. Yeah, it's, it's ridiculous. My, my little brother just got his license. 
It was crazy, y'all. Oh. Imagine on them all, and they're like, "Yay, yeah, big! He's gonna, he's gonna puke! He's gonna!" Yeah. Did you see that video? Mm -hmm. The one where I got Vince McMahon going. He's yeah. gonna puke. Yeah, it was pretty fun. That was fun. I was laughing my ass off. Mm -hmm. I had to go put some back on some duct tape. Mm -hmm. Can't loosen up my ass. It's my pride and joy. I had to rub that thing down like Kim Kardashian. I mean, now this is a problem. Hold on, I got a phone. This is a problem with cup whiskey. It's dry as tits, y'all. It's dry. Yes, it is. It's, it's, it's dry. It's dry. Okay. It's good and moist. Mm -hmm. Okay, by the way, much of the day for me is the... Oh, can you even see it? We are spitting in the new Odie Green Cryptek mud jug. I'm going to move on my jug to come right now. Mm. And I'm sure you get one of those, you get one of these. Free black mud jug, y'all. Black mud black. jug, classic. Classic black. And this one's clean. Yeah, it's clean. Well, for clean for the... To the well, to no, the this different. one's actually clean. It like brand new. I washed this one. Put my other one, forgot about it. I was like, I'm going to Outlaw's house. I grabbed my one I use every day, and I was like, it ain't going to my truck. Nope. I'm scratching on my other mud jugs, and I'm like, nope. This sucker looks brand new. I popped it open. Hey, what are you doing, man? No. What are you? You, you, you took Siri on. Mm hmm. Uh, fat boy just pushed Siri on my phone, and look what it says. It says, Text McQuaid. I watched this one, but, one, but my one forgot about it. <laughs> Send. <laughs> yeah, don't send. I don't even have a friend named McQuaid. Anyway, says McQuaid! McQuaid! Lone Wolf McQuaid! I Chuck Norris! Chuck Norris me! So, uh, okay, then we gotta tell this story. We've been talking about paparazzi and shit like that, right? Mm -hmm. Fatboy one time walked into uh, Walmart. Fat, no, I didn't go. I wasn't with you. No, Fat, it was by Fat, yourself. Yeah, Fat, Fat Boy was by himself at Walmart. Mm hmm. Mm. This was up, uh, probably two, three years ago, right? Three years ago, probably? Yeah, okay. that was a while ago. Well, Fat Boy was always in my videos. He didn't have his own channel at this point. No, I'm a lazy jackass. Yeah, and he uh, he was always on my channel and stuff. And he walks into Walmart and someone goes, "Hey, it's the Fat Man from YouTube." And I was like, "That's right, I'm a star." Right <laughs> now. The Fat Man. It's it's the Fat Boy, but the guy got it close. I didn't want to insult him, make him feel bad, mm -hmm. make him look stupid. You know. I'm Sometimes just like, people huh. call me, "Hey, man, it's the in-law." You know, I'm just like, whatever. It's the outlaws. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> so. Well, don't we treat our in-laws like outlaws? Yeah, I guess so. Um, I want you to tell a little uh, joke you got coming. Don't you have a joke for us? I got me a joke for you. Uh, here on the Hillbilly Hangout, we love redneck jokes. We love hillbilly jokes. Here, we just love everything about the country, y'all. Right, oh, well. oh, by the way, okay. Hmm. You ever see I'm wearing my Cummins hoodie? And we're sitting in a GMC, okay? Everybody's going to be like, what? You're in a Suburban, but you're wearing a Cummins hoodie. Okay, listen. Let me clear the fucking air, okay? Everybody's like... What the fuck are you wearing a Cummins hoodie for? You don't even have a Cummins. Okay, my woman, Miss Outlaw, bought this for me in Gatlinburg. She got it for me as a present, okay? The reason why is because when I was... In Alaska. In Alaska, as a fisherman, the boat that I was on for a couple years, it had a Cummins motor in it. I was always working on the Cummins motors, and my boat up there was a Cummins. The boat that I worked for is still up and running, and it has a Cummins motor in it. So that is why she bought it. I told her that one time, and then she bought the saw it, and she's like, oh, I'm going to get this for him. And plus, she likes Cummins. I like Cummins, okay? I'm not, you know, I fuck, y'all. You're a good engine. Listen, y'all, I like Power Strokes. I like Duramax, okay? Fuck, y'all. I don't give a shit what you like. I'm not one of those people that are like, oh, Chevy, oh, Ford. You know, him and I go back and forth. He's a Ford guy. I'm a Chevy guy, okay? I'm a yeah. GMC Chevy guy. Mm. We don't really mean okay, y'all? No. Just like what you want to like, freaking A. You know, the reason I don't drive Fords anymore is because every Ford that I've owned, I have problems with, okay? And that's not on Ford's fault. That's my fault, okay? I, I buy them shitty as fuck, all right? Yeah. If I bought a new fucking Ford Power Stroke 350, whatever, it'd probably oh. be nice. You're dead right. All right, I like Cummins, okay? Just yeah, get over me. it, You all buy right? a POS, no matter what you do, to, unless you drop in the big bucks, so it's going to be a POS. You milk them along, Don't. that's what a POS right. is. And don't be a silly bitch. That's bottom line. Don't be a silly bitch, okay? You're being a silly bitch, all right? Just don't be a silly bitch anymore. Yeah. All right, let's get to the freaking joke, y'all. I'm, right, right. I'm ready to laugh, son. This is the holiday theme. Holiday? It's the holidays, y'all. Yep. Oh, you can't really see, but there's Christmas lights all around this old bitch. Yep. Yeah. All right, y'all. You might be a redneck. you got to use duct tape to keep the oven door closed on the stove while cooking that Thanksgiving turkey. Oh, that's a good one right there. Right there. I said, hey, you might be a redneck if your secret family recipe is illegal. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, oh, you might be a redneck this Thanksgiving if you have a Elvis Jello mold. <laughs> mm, mm. Or, or you might be a redneck this Thanksgiving if you have your Thanksgiving dinner on your ping pong table. That might be true. Well, that's a good one. You got any more for us? 
Oh, come on. You can't be driving a bike right now, man. We're live, son. No, I'm on the spotlight. Don't look at me. No, oh, we're on the spotlight right Hey, I'm going to turn the spotlight to you. Oh, 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 right there. Oh, oh, it's spotlight off soon. Spotlight off soon. All right, y'all. Well, we, uh, we we wanted to come back on here. Mm -hmm. We're a pretty good tag team, man. Eh? Yeah, we think we, we should. We need to do more of these sons of bitches. I think people will enjoy this. What yeah, do you think? I think so. Mm -hmm. well, I should do this more often. Yeah, we got to do this more often. I'm going to be back here in about two weeks. Uh... Oh, we back. Maybe some people probably think that I'm staying in California. I'm actually not staying in California. I'm only gonna be in California for like two weeks. Yeah, helping out Mojo, and then I'm gonna go uh, come back here for a couple days, and then I'm gonna be going somewhere else. That's right. You guys, you guys, you guys, any ideas of where I'm going? Go and just leave in the comments. Hey, I got, we, I got, we're gonna make this a contest. I'm a smart. A con oh, you, you're smart. You're smart, mm -hmm. right now. I'm smart, right now. Okay, okay, let's hear. Y'all remember that T-Mobile? You know, catch Jeremy, not dish Jeremy, but you know that one. Okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> we gotta put subtitles on that son of a bitch because I don't think anybody understands me because I'm, I'm a fat boy. Uh, 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 I, I know everything that comes out of fat boy's mouth. I have no idea what you just fucking said. Uh, uh, so, slow, slow, slow. What we gonna do is have ourselves a contest. Like T-Mobile did that thing on the commercials. You know, CatsJeremy.com. Okay, what was that? CatsJeremy.com? That's right. Okay, cool. We understand thing. It's called Catch Outlaw. Com. Oh, okay, okay, catch Outlaw, I'll catch yeah, you. you can figure out where Outlaw's going, after Cali, from Cali back here, we'll do a video say, start, or go, something. If you figure out where he ends up, you win a prize. <laughs> I don't think anybody had an idea what you just said. Yeah, but not did like, what the some, hell? Some of, the, some of these redneck sons of bitches from, like, freaking, uh, you know, uh, uh, uh. Uh, you know, deep, 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 deep south. <laughs> you know, maybe they don't understand what you say because their papa's like, "Oh, so hang, oh, so hang, oh, so hang." It's so much, so much, so much, so much, so much. Yeah, yeah, Ching Chong Chang. Yeah, Ching Chong Kong Wong. Yeah, you know them Ching Chong Chang mother truckers. We ain't from Mexico. We don't know any Mexican voices. No. No, I guess. Or they call they call it language, not voices. Sorry. Oh, see, language. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We, we. Yeah. All right, y'all. I think that's about it, right? Oh, it is pretty, pretty insane. I don't know how long it's, it's going, but we're doing pretty good. <laughs> anyway, y'all, thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure to subscribe, and if you haven't yet, check out my main channel, Outlaw Dipper. We're throwing up videos over there. We're on the road, y'all. We're going to keep updating y'all on this channel. So stay tuned and subscribe, leave a comment, thumbs up the video, add it to favorites, all that other good crap. If you want. Mm. I don't give a damn. Hey, if you want to freaking share this video on Facebook or uh, the Book for Faces, you know, the the, the, the Twitter, uh, the, the, the the gram of Instas. That fancy shit. Yeah, yeah, whatever them other social networks are that I have. Go ahead. Just say, hey, look, these two dumb redneck sons of bitches. Hillbilly hangover. Well, shit. If you guys do. have a hangover, we're the hillbillies that'll make you feel better, and we hope that we did that yeah. after this uh, Thanksgiving weekend. And uh, maybe you, you guys... all need after dealing with your family. Yeah, dealing with your family, in-laws, whatever you're doing. We hope we, we hope we came here you and, and make killer feel shits after that turkey. You know that ten pound bird you eat, and it just come out and be like, boom. That's right, and the uh, spittoon that freaking. Uh, we deal with here at the Hillbilly Hangover. That's Mudjug Portable Spittoons, and you guys can go to mudjug.com get yourself one. This is the new Crip Tech. Come to Free Black and get yourself a black mud jug and plenty of other mud jugs over there at mudjug.com. Anyways, y'all, I think that's it for me. This is Fat Boy. Keep rocking, keep dipping, rock on. And this is Outlaw. And always remember, no matter what you're doing 24-7, I'll see you on the dip side. And always remember to keep it freaking hillbilly. Ah! Right, we gotta get out of this son of a bitch. Uh, yo, Fat Boy, getting out. Whoa, shit, crack kills, boy. God damn, son! <laughs>